Unbound Fam presents The Love Story of Sam and Mon. If you want to experience an emotional roller coaster, don't miss Gap the series, Thailand's first girl love series, based on Devil Play Noise novel of the same name, starring Freen Sarocha as Sam and Becky Armstrong as Mon. A love story about two women who face numerous challenges, including different social classes, and due to Sam's grandmother, who is royalty. They met 12 years ago. Since then, Mon has looked up to Sam as a role model and plans to work for Sam's company as soon as she graduates. Mon eventually met Sam, her idol, but she was nothing what she expected her to be, gentle, kind, and always smiling. Sam, 12 years later, has become this frigid person who is fighting what her grandma has decided for her company and marriage. Sam ultimately warmed up to Mon because of her honest demeanor, which she had not anticipated. No one in the company has ever disagreed with her, yet Mon never fails to express herself. Mon grew up in a humble family with a cheerful mother and stepfather. Sam gradually fell for Mon and became more attentive to her, expressing her sentiments in her own unique way. Mon, inadvertently beginning to realize that she never meant what she said, but rather the contrary. This was later confirmed by Sam's friends. As they enter each other's worlds, jealousy arises. Mon, over Kirk, Sam's fiancé, and Jim, Sam's friend, whom she kissed on the cheek. Sam, as opposed to Nop, Mon's friend, and Chin, a co-worker who flirts with Mon by sending stickers. This led to the nose and lip bite game, which was eventually broken during an overnight stay at Sam's house. When Sam attempted to terminate Mon because she wanted to court her thanks to the company policy, Mon misinterpreted this because Sam has never been upfront about it. Friends eventually helped them reunite, and Mon subsequently asked Sam to be her girlfriend. Sulking Mon is always the finest because we get to see Sam's soft side, the way she surrenders to her and lowers her pride for the sake of her sentiments and to prevent hurting Mon. They spent their first night together as a couple with the help of their friends, particularly Jim, because they lacked expertise in the subject. Their affection for one other strengthens with each situation they face. Sam's strong jealousy caused her to call Mon names, which she ultimately realized. Sam received her penalty for what transpired, which she described as severe. Sam eventually breaks up with Kirk and admits she is in a relationship with Mon, which tears his heart. Marriage was discussed over a weekend getaway, and they subsequently got engaged when Mon asked Sam to marry her. Their happiness is soon to be cut short by Sam's grandmother, who quickly judges Mon and declares that she will never be adequate for her granddaughter. Sam's grandma grew ill, and she decided to marry Kirk regardless of how heartbroken she is. Sam never had the courage to confront Mon and end their relationship, fearing that it would become a reality. Mon was able to meet Sam and conclude their relationship without blaming her since she understood Sam's decision to choose her family. Mon made the decision to let go and move on by moving to England to forget and begin again. Sam prepares for her wedding with no willpower, barely smiles, missing Mon, and becomes ill. Her grandmother notices this and recalls what happened to her other deceased granddaughter. She was terrified it would happen again, so she let go of Sam to pursue her happiness and the person she wants to be with. Sam was able to catch Mon on her way to the airport, and they reconciled. After conquering all of the challenges, they are getting married a few months later.